what we do here is go back, 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 back. Hello everybody, this is Bulldozer, and thank you for giving me your time, and thank you for watching another one of my videos. I really do appreciate you giving me your time. If you would, please consider using my code, Mr. Bulldozer Gaming. You can see it there in the center of the screen, also in the lower left-hand corner of the screen. But I think when you check my right there, you can not tell I am an epic partner. But here we go, folks. I got three quests for week seven for you. All going to be done in one game. These are all three Ferrari quests. You see, actually, we'll come back to the first one here in a second one. If you go down to the third one, it says, uh, actually, excuse me, excuse me, the second one, reach top speed in a Ferrari 296 GTB. That's actually not hard to do at all. Um, and actually, really, it's you don't reach the top speed. And I'll explain it to you in the video. Then there at the very bottom, it says, drive a Ferrari 296 GTB through the storm. Again, very very easy maybe you understand why now that we're gonna get all three of these done in one game the hardest thing that you're gonna to have to do is going to be the time trials complete a Ferrari 296 GTB time trials you see we got three of them got one at Lazy Lake we got one in between a Slurpee Swamp and Whit and um, Weeping Woods then we got one by the gas station uh, on the road on the way to Holly Hatchery coming from uh, let's say weeping woods um, again I'm gonna do the one in lazy lake the one thing I recommend you doing is basically taking and getting in a car if, uh, unless you're lucky enough to drop onto a Ferrari get into a car and just drive around and find one if you do not uh, grab a gas can because you are going to need a gas can actually uh, I don't know if you'll see my inventory or not I actually have two gas cans just to make sure because when you hit the boost on the Ferrari it burns through the gas let's get started okay here I'm in a taxi again I'm just driving around trying to find a Ferrari if I find one I find one if I don't I don't I don't do not know the exact location of these they are they did um, replace the whiplashes and the whiplashes used to be all over the place then they did an update uh, some time ago where they was kinda hard to find now so now we're on the road on the way to Steamy Stacks. And I know there's a car. I came this way because sometimes there's a car sitting on top of this truck right here. And sure enough, here is a Ferrari. Now look, when we get in the Ferrari, there's only 29% fuel in it. So I know right away I'm going to have to get a gas can. So again, I can tell you one thing. This thing handles so much better than the Whiplash. I mean, you can make your tight turns and everything. You can see, actually, I already picked up a gas can because um, I knew I'd probably need, I would need one because of the fact of, you know, it's supposed to be faster than the whiplash and everything, which means it's going to burn more gas. If it's going faster, it's going to burn more gas. And actually, I ended up picking up a second gas can. I don't know if you'll see that in this video or not. But we're making our way over to Lazy Lake. Or, excuse yeah, Lazy Lake. So I'm just going to stay on the road. You see, we just completed the challenge right there. And that challenge is actually for reaching top speed. That was only in the middle 70s. Now, here, look, this is top speed, 117 miles per hour. So why I got that, I don't know. Here we are. You see, now I have two gas cans. I'm only at 25% fuel, so I'm going to go ahead and fill this up. I don't know where everybody is. There is nobody in Lazy Lake at all. I'm shocked there's nobody here. Because you're basically making one big circle all the way around Lazy Lake. So you get in the car. You go around this tree. Right behind this truck there's one. We'll make a hard right right here and go on the side of this truck to make a hard left. Another hard right. And here you're going to make a hard right and, and hit the boost when you hit this one here. You go through these two walls here and you want to hit the boost again right here. You are going to have to use your boost to keep that in mind. That's the only way you're going to complete those. And there you go, folks. All three of the Ferrari challenges done in one game. And here, the other thing is, too, you see somebody shooting at me? When you hit that boost, you get out of dodge really, fa really fast and uh, you get away from whoever is trying to shoot you. Now, for confirmation, I'll show you the three green check marks. You can see there are the first two that drive the Ferrari through the storm, the time trials, and down here at the very bottom, 
reach top speed. Thank you for watching. Thank you for giving your time. I really do appreciate it. This is the Bulldozer. Get your killing on. And I'm out of here. Hope you enjoyed the video you just watched. Here's some more videos you might be interested in. On the left hand side, my Fortnite playlist. On the right hand side, the previous video I uploaded. Who knows what this could be? It could be a dash cam footage. It could be something about on YouTube. It could be a number of things. Thank you for watching. Thank you for giving me your time. This is the Bulldozer. Get your killing on. And I'm out of here.